When you use iCloud Photos, you can view your photos and videos on any device and download a copy of them using the Photos app, iCloud.com, and more. We'll teach you how. First, let's learn a little about iCloud Photos. You can view your photos and videos in several places. When you sign in to your Apple account on your Apple devices and have iCloud Photos turned on in Settings, all your iCloud Photos and videos show up in the Photos app automatically. If you're using iCloud for Windows or signed in with your Apple account and have iCloud Photos turned on, you can find your iCloud Photos and videos stored locally on your PC. If you prefer to use the web, you can manage and download them from iCloud.com on any device. When you're connected to Wi-Fi or cellular, any changes you make to your content appear across your devices, including new photos and videos you take. When you delete content from your device, it's also removed from iCloud and any of your devices that have iCloud Photos enabled. Depending on the device you're using, you have several options for downloading photos and videos. Now let's learn about a few ways. We'll show you how to download your iCloud photos and videos from your iPhone or iPad and put them on an external storage device, how to download your entire library from the Photos app on Mac, and how to download your photos and videos from iCloud.com. First, let's learn how to download iCloud photos and videos using your iPhone or iPad and then transfer them to an external storage device. Before you start, make sure your device is up to date. On your iPhone, you'll need iOS 17 or later, and on your iPad, you'll need iPadOS 17 or later. Make sure you have enough storage space on your iPhone or iPad to download your content, even if you're using optimized storage. You'll also need a compatible external storage device. Connect your storage device to your iPhone or iPad. If you're downloading a large amount of content, it's a good idea to connect to Wi-Fi. In the Photos app on your iPhone or iPad, find the photos and videos you'd like to download to your storage device. These photos and videos are the same ones stored in iCloud when you have iCloud Photos enabled. Then tap Select and choose the photos and videos you'd like to download. Tap the Share button. And then tap Export Unmodified Originals. You might need to scroll down first. This will download full resolution copies of your original photos and videos. If you're using optimized iPhone or iPad storage, you might get an alert showing the progress. The Files app will open to iCloud Drive by default. Tap the back arrow, and under Locations, tap your external storage device. Tap Save, and your content will begin to download to your storage device. When the download is complete, you can disconnect your storage device and you're good to go. You can use the Photos app on Mac to download your entire iCloud Photos library. Before you start, make sure you have enough storage space on your Mac to download your content. It's also a good idea to back up your Mac using Time Machine when you're done in order to save your data, which includes your downloaded full-resolution photos and videos. The Photos app shows all your photos and videos stored in iCloud when iCloud Photos is enabled. With the app open, click Photos in the menu bar in the upper left corner of your screen. Click Settings, and then select iCloud at the top of the window that appears. Now choose how you want to download your photos. You can select Optimize Mac Storage to download a lower resolution version of your photos and videos, which takes up less space on your Mac. But we're going to choose Download Originals to this Mac. This downloads your entire iCloud library with your photos and videos in full resolution. Then, click the Close button on the Settings window. Depending on how much content you're downloading, a message might appear showing the progress. When it's done, you can export your content to an external storage device if you like. Now, let's learn how to download photos and videos from iCloud.com to your Mac, PC, iPhone, or iPad. We're using a Mac. Keep in mind that it's a good idea to back up your device when you're done to save all your data, which includes your downloaded content. 
Once you're signed in to iCloud.com, click Photos. By default, it will appear near the top of the page, but you might need to scroll down first. Now, select the items you'd like to download. You can download up to 1,000 at a time. You can click the Download button to download them right away, or for additional options, click the More button. You can click the More Download Options button to choose what type of media you want to download, like copies of your original photos and videos, or ones that include edits you've made. We're going to click Download Items. Depending on the amount of photos and videos you're downloading, they might save as a zip file and will be located in your Downloads folder by default. Once they're downloaded, you can export them to an external storage device. And that's how to download a copy of your iCloud photos and videos so you can store them exactly where you want. To learn more about your Apple devices, subscribe to the Apple Support YouTube channel or click another video to keep watching. Some sequences in this video were shortened.